Have you ever heard the term Exhuma Christo? Well, if you have not, then it means to release Christ. A group in the Dominican order, born from the investigations in the Catholic Inquisition, had an epiphany that Christ, when his body was most weak on the cross, was most free, and thus his atemporal plea to forgive all sins from man was possible. When the Inquisition ended, and they could no longer, through inquisiting, learn how the soul leave the weakened body, they traveled to other places where the Catholic Church deemed heretical behavior was present that could threaten the sanctity of the whole. That group lived on through the Gui line, the last known one being Bernardino Gui. He was on either the Nina, the Pinta, or the Santa Maria. He continued the research in what would become the Bahamas, now through conversion, not inquisition. Alone, he left the company of Columbus per an agreement he had in aiding Columbus gain royal favor initially. No one knew how successful he was in converting, but a diary from a priest in Hispaniola wrote that some Indians from where Columbus landed were brought in and were physically damaged beyond knowing. One of them, who was not scared, spoke Spanish and was named Channing. He said, Father Gui would try to exhume their souls to release them from their physical shackles. I asked about Gui, and he said Gui died. I took the boy in, and as he knew the proper ways. The rest I sent to the fields, hoping whatever pain they knew in life can die quietly or silently or unknowingly in the plains.